Games are so different from other forms of media that we're used to using. In traditional media, magazines and uh, television, we're given a story, we're told someone's take on something. So with game, we turn that on its head, and instead of starting with the individual experience, we look at the system and how it kind of produces those experiences. Games are good for persuading people to see the world in a different way. So my question for you is, how can video games become the next persuasive medium for addressing complex social issues? I use the name persuasive game to describe a video game that's used to present them with a situation or an idea that they hadn't considered. If you take freight piracy as an example, which you know, seems like a kind of strange example, but it's been in the news. Somali piracy has generally been characterized as this kind of anarchistic disruption of global commerce, and we hear those stories in the news. And those are interesting perspectives, but there are perspectives, and if you ask, well, what are the pirates uh, really experiencing, or what are they trying to do, is it the same as what we think they are? So Wired Magazine did this feature online as a game about the economics of piracy, and they tried to recast the subject not as one about politics, not as one about the personalities of conflict, but about the business of piracy itself. The player learns quickly that they must immediately identify the potential value of a vessel, and then they must work methodically to produce a modest ransom. Piracy becomes more like a business than like politics. Seeing the subject of piracy from the pirate's perspective, but then also from the perspective of like the balance sheet, rather than the perspective of the captor or global trade, uh, gives us a new perspective on, on, the, on the issue, helps us see something about it that we wouldn't necessarily see from a news story by experiencing it ourselves. The vast majority of big challenges that we face in the world are systemic challenges. The global economy, climate change, energy. Games are most useful as persuasive tools when they tackle these, these kind of big problems that are, are, are interdependent and complicated. This is what I'm after in my games. I'm after discourse, more sophisticated, complex conversation about issues. Persuading ourselves to be willing to see them as systems of behavior rather than stories about individual people.